As a researcher, you don't always have the opportunity to see the impact of your work firsthand. And so being part of this project has been really wonderful. Clearly, what we've done has been very influential in, in, in changing minds around the country. So in the ACT, We've been working as a group for quite a number of years now to develop drug checking as a health service. The ACT has led the way here. Uh, so first festival trial in 2018, the first fixed site or, or drop-in was, was opened in July 2022. What we've done here with the evaluation team is to create some of the most robust evidence we have in the world um, around how people are finding the service as well as what people are doing with that information and behavioural change. We've tested thousands and thousands of substances for thousands of people. Each one of those clients will have more information about the substances that they're intending to take than they had up before they visited the service. So as a harm reduction intervention, we want to know, are people taking that information on board and are they changing their drug use behaviour? What we can see so far is yes. So there's lots of moving parts to the CAN test service and lots of different ways that the different groups involved have connected to the community. So we work closely with government, of course, uh, there's issues with law. We have to work with the consumer organisations, so that the people who represent drug users, uh, to make sure that the services that we're presenting are going to be acceptable and accessible to, to that cohort. 20 years working in the drug and alcohol sector, I've seen a lot of changes. Um, we're increasingly seeing that researching with rather than on um, the communities of people who use drugs is, is a necessity. It is an important aspect of our work actually that the kind of science that we do, we have to be able to communicate that. This small service in the ACT is actually reaching a huge number of people across Australia. The communications that are coming from the service have been distributed through social media as well as public health networks. And so that information about the drug market, which we really didn't have before, is being provided by the CANTES service. So being part of this project has been really wonderful to be able to talk to community members and have them, for example, say, this is the first time I've ever talked to someone about my drug use, means that the service is making a difference. And seeing a real impact for, for the chemistry that you do in the hands of the general public, it's a fantastic project.